Okay. What's up, Money Geeks? Mr. V here. Welcome to another video, guys. So in this one, we're going to be really, really brief. I want to give you guys a quick update on the NVIDIA situation. Uh, we'll talk about what's happening in um, how things are gonna develop uh, starting tomorrow. So that's what I wanted to talk about into this video. But before we get started, guys, if you're new to the channel, we talk about how to earn money, how to save money, how to invest and build wealth. So if that's something that interests you, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content. So guys, again, this is just gonna be a quick update. I uh, remember I've done several videos here on the channel where I talk about the situation with NVIDIA, your stock split, and why I'm super excited about this, why I'm covering this stock, because uh, we can see here, NVIDIA has been a monster. So in, I wasn't in the stock, so I'm thinking this is probably an opportunity for me to start building um, a position in the stock. Again, when I look at NVIDIA, I'm looking at other companies like Tesla that went through the split, what happened, and how they recovered. So I'm like, I'm positioning myself so that I can average my way into the stock. So um, for those of you that are already in the stock, this might not mean anything for you, uh, but if you care more about it, here's what's gonna happen. So if we just go back here and look at where Nvidia is trading right now. So Nvidia is currently trading at $751.19. So this, again, this is after hours. So as of today, that I'm doing this video is July 19. Uh, when you get up tomorrow morning, you're gonna see a change in your account. Your account balance is gonna be the same, but the way everything is structured is gonna be a little bit different. So Nvidia actually did a four for one split. So this is what's gonna happen here. Let me bring up a calendar here. So if you take um, your one share of Nvidia, it's divided out by four, you're gonna see, so you're gonna see in your account, it's gonna say four, you're gonna see you have four shares at the average price of $187.70, and um, yeah, 79 cents. So uh, in that case, you, when, you, when you put the total, it's gonna sum back up to $751.19. So technically, you're not losing any money, you're just basically uh, getting more shares, but for the same amount. So, and then if the shares start growing from there, you'll have more shares. So that's the reason why Nvidia actually did the split because they wanted more people, uh, more investors to get into the share because they at one point think that the share was too expensive and they were not getting a ton of investors. So this would definitely entice more people to get into the stock. Like myself, uh, I'm super excited now to get into the stock. If you can see, um, again, like I said, Tesla did the, uh, the exact same thing. So that's what I wanted to cover here. So uh, starting tomorrow, uh, July 20th, the stocks are, are gonna be trading at the split adjusted basis. Again, like I explained there, so you open your account, if you have one share of Nvidia, now you're gonna see total number of shares is gonna be four, but the value is gonna be the same, but the, the price per share is gonna change. But when you put the four shares, it's gonna give you back the exact amount that you had when, uh, when you own just one share. So that's pretty much what's gonna happen here, guys. So again, uh, this is just a quick update. I wanna make sure that you guys are aware of this. My game plan here moving forward is that as soon as this thing splits and comes out at $187, I still think there's probably some room there for a pullback. So I'm anticipating that um, maybe if this thing can come down to like 160, 150, that would be the perfect place. Again, right now that the market's a little bit shaky, so if that would be a place for me to start picking up some good shares and holding long term. Um, the goal now is just to buy and store and just store it and um, see what what happens. If we can go back again to three, four, five hundred dollars, boy, trust me, I'll be happy, man. So that is my game plan. I want to get into Nvidia and I'm gonna try to see um, average my way into the stock. So again, I'm gonna start looking that 150 price point. If, if I feel like it's not gonna get there, I'm gonna pick up a few shares, even at 170 and 160, and then wait again to see 140, 150, pick up a few average my way so that if my average comes out to about maybe 155 or 160, um, that's not terrible for Nvidia. I might still be happy uh, with that situation again. So let me know in the comment section uh, what you think about this. Are you waiting to get into Nvidia like myself or are you already, already in Nvidia? And if yes, do you plan on adding to your position or you just plan on keeping it status quo? So again, let me know in the comment section if you're new to the channel,
we talk about how to earn money, how to save money, how to invest and build wealth. So if that's something that interests you, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content. Also, guys, if you're looking to get started with investing, Weibo has the promotion where if you sign up and deposit $100, you get free stocks. Links in the description below. And as always, guys, do your due diligence. Don't be a greedy savage. Stay motivated.